Hello and welcome to DSD Lab. In this experiment, we will learn how to design XOR and XNOR logic gates using MultiSim software. We will simulate them and verify the logic operation. Exclusive OR logic gates is like OR gates, only it differs from it in last condition when both inputs are high. When one input of XOR gate is high, the output will be high. When both inputs are same, the output will be low. XOR function symbol is like circuit OR. And XOR logic symbol is like OR but rounded line beside of it. We come to truth table and we see when both inputs are low or high, the output is low. But when one input is high, the output is high so we have two conditions which yields high state 1 and state 2 if you write x or function will be a bar and b or a b bar if we convert the logic function to logic circuit will be like this a bar and b or a and b bar let's design x or circuit using multism software in the lab, we just use TTL IC chip logic gates. Each logic gate has its own number. For example, 7408 is, uh, belongs to AND gates, 7400 for NAND gate, 7444 NOT gate, and 7432 for uh, OR gate, and so on. But here in Multisim, to be easy for us, we will use MISC Digital. TIL components. For example, if we want to use AND gate, we will just write its name in search component. We have two input, three input, and more. So now we will use XOR gate, we'll just write XOR to input and we'll place this component. Now we need inputs and outputs for our gate. We'll place input. We have two methods to implement input for our digital logic gates. I will show you both methods and will tell which method is better. We come to place source and we will place VCC, which is 5 volt digital. And we will place digital ground also. I will place basic switch this type this is for first switch or a this is for b and come to resistor i'll place two resistors here k i will initialize k for toggle i will give k a on keyboard to toggle this input also for k b I will give key B for toggling this switch and I will normally connect it. I will place both inputs to VCC but here this method called pull down resistor because when switches are open inputs connected to the ground by resistors when switch are open only ground will pass through resistors to logic gates and now i place indicator i will place a probe digital rate I'll place here i'll rotate it like this i can't rename it to f like truth table let's run the design and see the output when uh, both switch are open it means 0 0 a0 and b0 output will be 0 if I close switch B 0 1 output will be 1 and if I close switch a output will be 1 because one of switch is open when both switch are closed output will be zero both inputs are the same one one output will be zero if both are zero output will be zero now we will design x or function using and or not logic gates we come to place misc digital and we just write 
nuts replace two nuts and or and you connect them so here it was a bar b and here it was a b bar so let's run the program and see state 0 0 0 output will be 0 0 1 output will be 1 both of them same x or logic gets 1 0 output will be 1 and 1 1 output will be 0 so now we come to other gets uh, this time we'll use other method of inputs we come to place basic we come to switch spdt we just flip them horizontally double click on a change value to a key press and b also it's labeled to b place upper side to vcc and the lower side will connect to, to the ground can't change the wire color to black and now it's A switch and this is the B switch so let's run the program and see 0001 when the switch change from 1 to 0 it goes through a gap and the gap between switch make like sparks and this is not good for electronic circuits so we use pull up or pull down resistor methods to prevent this condition so now we will change this component replace component We'll say X nor. We'll replace it by X nor gate. And we'll remove this component. If we run the program and see, it's totally different from X or gate. So X nor, when both zero, when both input are the same, output will be one when zero zero and one one and all other states output will be zero i will just implement that conditions i will just come to rest til and not function for this and this I run the program and see <coughs> when both uh, input are zero, output will be one. When both input are the same, zero zero, zero one, one zero, one one. So now last state and first state 
output will be 1 I can use another instrument which is called logic converter I will just place it here I will give two inputs and I will connect them and verify that outputs output will be 1001 if I want to change it to boolean equation will be like this if simplified also will be like this if I change it to get will implement a circuit like this 